Carter Johannes Larson. From the moment I met you, I knew there was something special that I couldn't pass up. You are the most selfless, loving, patient person I have ever met, and I couldn't imagine standing here today beside anyone else. I choose you, the one who loves and supports me on my worst days and laughs till we cry on the best. My life has been forever changed. You are my person and for that reason, I promise to be a rock when times are tough. I promise to always laugh at your jokes even if they may not be funny. I promise to love and support you and help you achieve all of your goals. And I promise to hold your hand through the good and the bad. Uh, I promise not to get angry at you for making honest mistakes even if I asked you to rinse the smelly cat food spoon before it's put into the dishwasher a million times. So Carter, I want to thank you for coming into my life as easy as a swipe of the finger and continuing to show me every day what real love is and always telling me I'm beautiful when I don't feel that I am. I love you so much. Cassidy Ann Maximic. My crunch, my love bug, my sweetie pie. You are my favorite person, my confidant, my lover, and my best friend. There isn't a moment that goes by where I'm not thinking about you, or what you're doing, where you are, if you're hungry, tired, happy, or sad. You're always on my mind, and you have been from the moment we met. I remember when I was waiting to pick you up that cold October night, I kept peeking over, trying to sneak a peek of you before you got there, but you were nowhere to be found. You snuck up and scared the absolute crap out of me. Then you hopped in my truck with your fluffy slippers on and smiled. My heart melted. Since then, we've climbed mountains, bought a house, we've got three fur babies, made it through a pandemic, and now here we are standing at the altar. Cassidy, I vow to treat every day like it's our last. To make every moment count and to make you laugh, smile, and to keep things fun. Until death do us part, in good times and bad, I want you by my side as my wife. embarrassing to admit that I can't recall actually meeting Carter for the first time. <laughs> I don't know when we first actually connected and started chatting. Uh, I'm not sure how long ago it was. I'm guessing it's around seven years. Although the length of time of our friendship has been unspecific, Carter has always made it clear who he was, what his intentions were, and little did I know that this is something that Carter would be a main trait that you always carry throughout your life. Uh, you have a passion for bikes, but also a genuine care and willingness to make things right in every situation. Um, it's only really superseded these two traits by two other loves in your life, of course, Cassidy, and his love for Tim Hortons Ice Cap. <laughs> <laughs> Carter and Cassidy, you found a house and turned it into your very own home. You started your family with some beautiful fur babies, yes. you, and you are en route to building long, prosperous careers. And now, each of you get to marry an incredibly amazing person that brings joy to your life. These aren't mistakes or luck. With your passion and care for each other and the same inspiring effort of witness in all the other aspects of a life, you made this happen. So for those of you who don't know me, I'm basically Cassidy's annoying little sister. We have always been close, even through the hard times. Her and her family have always supported me. Um, and took me in when I was feeling like I didn't have anyone else to turn to. I've always looked up to my big sister and all of her achievements, and here we are today to celebrate one of the biggest achievements yet. Finding her true soulmate that really is her perfect match. When I tell you these people were made for each other, I mean it. They bring out the best in each other, both so caring for each other and everyone else in their lives. 
both so freaking hilarious and adventurous. <laughs> I mean, what a cute mountain biking couple. Cassidy is truly an amazing friend, sister, and daughter. Always supporting and loving people with her whole heart. She truly wants the best for people. And I know she will make an amazing wife who will support, care, <laughs> and love Carter with all her will. I see the way he looks at her and the way he treats her. And, he, ow, and how he handles her sass. And good job, <laughs> props to you. And I know with all my heart that he will make an amazing husband, always making her laugh and feel special. It's the simplest memory. It's the way they laugh together, love together, <laughs> sass together, motivate each other that shows that these two are truly inseparable. So, first off, I wanted to thank everybody for coming today. Uh, it's like, it feels so good to have you all a part of this. And it wouldn't be the same without you here. More specifically though, I wanted to thank Laura and Norm, not only for those kind words earlier, but for bringing my beautiful wife into this world and for raising her into the kindest, smart, and most beautiful woman in the entire world. I don't know what I would have done if you had said no when I asked you guys if I could marry her, because I'd already made up my mind. And thank you for welcoming me into your family with open arms from day one. Mom and Dad, I don't know where to start. Honestly, over the last 27 years, you two have taught me more and more than I could have ever imagined. But it really, but it, it's only stuck in the last couple years. Maybe you guys are getting wiser with your old age, or I'm actually like cleaning my ears these days, but uh, it's working. And Cassidy, thanks for always being here.